Uh, that's right. It's that time, you guys. We are moving fast. You know, I'm so happy that this is a Wednesday, which is our Friday. Welcome to Hot Picks, where we do fashion model ratings across the board. Men and women, three picks, three picks for each. And we rate them one to ten, ten being best. And then when we initially rate them, we rate them personally or commercially. It doesn't matter. There are no rules on what guidelines you have to follow. But at the end, we do want to see if we can pick out somebody who may have more commercial success or opportunity for success. And today we're going to start off with the ladies. And before I go anywhere else, I have to make sure the gimpy one, the Jack Lane replacement for the future, Mario is ready. I'm ready. Okay, he's all ready, you guys. It's been three hours, so I got to call the doctor another hour. <laughs> okay, here we go, you guys. The ladies are going to go up first. It's only two of us in this camp, and Jalen is out of Detroit, Michigan. Notice I said Detroit, not Detroit. Yeah. She says, my tummy hurts, and I need a prescription. Is that true, Mario? She's an enema. You know That's what? from the Packers. Oh, you, you know, she must be a Packer fan. Okay. All right. That's what yeah. they pack it. Yeah, okay, you know something. First of all, can you start off with a little bit of quality and taste? But I'm saying she's wonderful. Okay. She's wonderful. I'm looking at the picture. I'm not sure if I like the nails. How do you see things that, like... Well, you, the light, the hand looks kind of light. The lighting's a little intense on the picture. You, so I, you, I, I have some issues you, with the picture, but you she's look fine. For, you look for stuff, don't you? Yeah, because she's fine. And she's little petite, isn't she? Yeah, you like those types. Yeah, you? I do. She, I, I like about five foot one or two. Uh, yeah, yeah, I had these. Yeah, you're stuttering. 9.2. Oh, why are you taking off point eight? I'm taking off... All the stuff I'm taking off really doesn't have much to do with Baby Girl. Because Baby Girl, you are one fine cookie. So, I don't really like the picture, the uh, white background. Got you. It's kind of bright with the light here. Right. Okay, so, and it makes this hand look really hot. Right. So I'm not sure, and then a really big old flaming light reflection on her titty. Could you say breast to help breast, those? Breast right here. we have young viewers. See my cursor? Okay. So what y'all call breast, what I call titty. <laughs> you don't have to explain. But, but make sure you understand. <laughs> so, uh, but that's all I'm taking off because it's not you, baby. Is, oh. she, is she local? Uh, Detroit. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> so fly out if you got some freaking flyers. Okay, Detroit. I take you. To, I take you to Universal Studios, though. <laughs> okay, come on, come on out. All right. Uh, hey, I got to be part of this game because it's just Mario and myself. I actually agree with you on this one, man. It. I think there could have been a better background. Period. And you know what? When you're going to pose, and your arms are wrapped across like that, you don't know what she's you're like, trying she's to ask. She's like getting the bike. She needs to poop. I was just saying her tummy hurts. You were really going to another place, and I think you kind of stuck on that area because you got sound effects like that. Wonderful so, poop sounds. Yeah, right. Now, the other part, I say your, her strength may be having a shot forward, being straightforward. She is in condition. She is petite. Uh, she, She's she being directed by a photographer because you know, I would love to see her turn more forward and smile. Yes, I would too. And, there, and there are other pictures, but this is the one that actually had a scale where you could present it in a full uh, portrait mode, so to speak. So I'm gonna give her, I'm gonna give her about uh, nine, nine flat, man. I gotta go nine flat. Yeah, yeah I, I want to see. But I love more. you, baby. <laughs> Okay. Hey, you guys, you know something? Most of the time, people have controversy with certain types of creative presentations. I've always said that nude or nudity can also be curved around quality. Sometimes it's difficult, but we give it a chance and an opportunity here. Lene is out of Oakland, California. She says nudity can be considered artful creativity. Is that true, Mario? It can, and it is. Show me some nudity, and I'll show you artful creativity. I'm serious. It is. Okay, you say and so. And, you know, she, this is an interesting look. I've used this position before. Uh, you know. In a lot of ways. Is there a message? Let me say this. I'm, I'm not <laughs> The message is that pelvic thrust Wait a keep minute. her abs in shape. Wait a minute. What's the purpose of the shoes? I don't know. You have to get that from her. Because I'm not so sure about a bunch of things in the shot. <laughs> the white, the spider, the white, the background, the right. bleeds. No, it's kind of overlit. Okay. I'm not sure I like the facial presentation or the hair. Okay. So, but she's pretty, and she obviously can stay in this position for a while. Right. So, you know, she could probably take up some ballers. So, but anyway, I'm going to give her an 8.5. 8.5. Okay, look, the part that I say is, is that when you combine your, I guess you could say your picture profile with shots like this, this young lady's shots, 
she, most of them are closed shots, rare one or two picks like this. So I have to turn around and say, there's a message why you're sending this. The shoes, I don't know what the statement is. Three, it is hard to make nudity artful and creative when you're looking at a pose like this. So somebody's going to ask, well, Victor, why did you present it? I said, because you need to see the evaluation and the feedback. I absolutely say, what's the message? I said, mm, I don't know if it's that artful. So I'm going to give you a 7.0. I don't mean Ooh. to be mad. I, only Ooh. reason why I'm saying that is because, like you said, what's the message? Because their nudity can be presented in a different way. So, hey, opportunity. Don't think that she doesn't get a lot of popularity. She's popular with this shot, but we have to go to the next level. <laughs> I knew he was going to do that. But it's time to move on to the next because everybody gets equal opportunity. We're not going to be one-dimensional here. Ishanik is out of Los Angeles, California, and she says, my outfit has a few holes in it. Mario, can you Come on the show. <laughs> Come on the show. It's your fine self. I love your lip gloss, <laughs> baby. Come on the show. I'm looking at you, and I'm saying that's wonderful. Let me go to the big screen. Oh, girl, I like it. Your well, brow's looking good, girl. The attitude. Uh-huh. So, you know, and you, you look like you're tall. You're big and tall, what I look like. Long leg look. I liked what you did with the belly button. And I want to see the, your wax job up closer. You know what? So I'm going to give, you know, so the whole thing is a stylistic thing. Right. A stylistic representation because when you bring in the fishnet, you know, that's kind of hoish. But that's okay. It's, if you, but I'm saying it's bringing a certain vibe. Well, is it is it picking up fishnets way back in the day? I always did bring that what, vibe. Was I'm not it, saying it's was not. It, was it quality at one time? Go back when no, fishnets it's were first. Been hit. But you know, in the uh, Mario, if you go look at films and pictures, uh -huh. Marilyn Monroe, the whole back in the like day. Like I said, I know <laughs> she wasn't a hoe. I'm just saying she, she was using some hoe vibes. Time she some hoe vibes. I mean, it's cool. Because I'm going to give her a 9.5. Oh, man. You like that one, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, I'm I only can tell. Off for the white back. I'm not crazy about these backgrounds. Yeah, I know. You know, hers fits better. Oh, uh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? And okay. I'm still not 100%. I like 9.5. Okay. Yeah, and, and look, got to give props to Facet Studio. They always have had models. Come on in the studio. And selected uh, some pics Come from on group. down to the studio. Get yeah, on morning yeah. coffee. You're trying. You're hustling. Facet. But let me Just do this. Facets. It is hard to do the fishnet thing a certain way. Uh, she's beautiful. Yeah, of course she is. She's a little... She's, she's thicker for the traditional models, of course. We know that. And I figured you were going to applaud that. And I'm, I'm all for it because I believe trends can be set in all types of forms and fashion. But... At this time, I'm going to say beautiful for the men. Men are going to love this and say, man, not only top to bottom. Now, on the other hand, you got to be careful. So I'm going to say. You got to be careful. You get her tested. What? what well, I'm just saying, though, if, you, if you're going to go commercial, you got to be. What's the message here? What are you selling that's going to make people say, hey, we want to use you in a very strong commercial product? Very difficult. It might be. It's more like the rapper videos. You, hey, got a point. Yeah, that's, that's commercial. What I mean. so you What's know, commercial? You may not, may not be what you want. Yeah, but it's still commercial. It's well, what well, type of commercial? It's a hot. See, it's remember the outfit. I'm sure she has stuff that's in different kinds of outfits. Yeah. This is a sex outfit. Yes, it is. So you know that brings a different thing. Now, another right. thing to consider. I'm not sure if I go with the little, the hair streak. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm kind of cool with that. You know, the reason why I'm, I'm cool with that, I think hair streaks within the right package, you tend to go like it enhances someone's profile. It's just how it. Well, enhances. If, if if you were talking about trying to make her cross over, right, it would to probably. that other stuff, then she got to get a different hairstyle that's more conservative. Yeah, and a different outfit. But she may have had those. But either way, baby, come on, we we'll buy you lunch. <laughs> Fish and grits. Okay. Or some fish. I know you eat. You like right. to eat some fish and grits. Okay. Well, let me go to give my score on this one because, you know, it is important to know that, uh, yeah, beautiful. But I say, hey, if you want to pick up that commercial money, big commercial money, you may have to do some things differently. I'm going to give her 8.75. Oh, yeah, oh. Go yeah, 8.75. I got to go there. So, you know, Mar, we're going to have to switch over to the other side, man, because, you know what, we're supposed to represent the men as it relates to trying to figure out what women would see in them and if we feel that we could ever be up here to be judged can we be a can you be a male model man are you able to do that man i got the badass one pack and i got the b cup <laughs> you wrong so i wrong. can do it all right we're going to start off with Cesar and Caesar. I call him Caesar Omar, Columbia, South Carolina. Now, I have to apologize for something because there's a letter missing in this statement. He says, I am I'm not the dark knight, but I'm working on it. Mario, the photo is kind of dark. Yeah, he's got a cone head, too. 
Like when them cone heads, you know, you see the cone heads. Oh. Yeah, when them domes. You yeah. look at their head, you can see like a cathedral action. You're right. And you know, and he also he's got the whole chess kind of thing happening here. But is he pulling off style a commercial of, style for you? I man? think it's. I think it is a style, and I think the roughness of the features set works with everything. Right. And that, I'm gonna give him a nine point three. Okay, you give him a nine point three. I'm yeah. gonna say this. I'm just it's saying it is. It is a different look. But see, I like the strong stri- strength of that nose and mouth. Right. You know that's. A, it's, but he's got. He is a cone head. But people like the cone head. I'm going to leave that alone. Hey, look, look I, I'm going to say this right offhand. The photography, the type of image they're doing, it is supposed to be a darker image. That's To me, it's done on purpose. So I'm going to look at it the way it is. Mm-hmm. The other part, if I said, if the women were looking at this, Mario, I think they would sit there and say, you know what? I want to see more meat. If you're going to open up your chest shirt and everything, I want to see some thickness on there. It That's doesn't have to be buffed. To... Don't have to be buffed. Just got to see some more thickness. Well, you twit pics. Yeah, he can twit pick some uh, genital photos. And that'll really help. Go on and get some out all there. Right, all right. Look, first of all, can the mer- can, can the brother work print? Yes, he can because maybe he don't have to open his shirt. And maybe this is print paid. I can't judge that. So I'm going to go ahead and give him a nine because I think he can still do the modeling. I think the women are going to want to see more. Yeah, people. I do too. I, you see, that's why I said it. Even when I think he still has a look. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. We're going to go to our next one. Studio Nero is the photography. And this brother's staying anonymous. This pic and this person is out of philadelphia pennsylvania he says i'm focused on my next goal mario does he have the look like he's selling something or is he he almost looks like he's a performing artist well he does and he it is it is something about his grabbing you wish you could hear what he has to say right you know but you know this is a casual photo you know catching him in a straight moment. up right moment straight. nice shot right uh you know, just came off good the, the composition, and he's selling it right. Um, and so, I, so I think it's pretty good. Yeah, I'm gonna give him a nine point two. Oh, good. All right. Okay. Good. You know, I'm gonna say this is a simple shot. You know, it, it to me, I think the simple the better. It's not about his background. It's really about him, his face. You know, headshot is more focused on the a simple t-shirt, simple focus. Basically, I think the women would like to see probably see more. So I think they would actually say, I would love to see more on this. So, But I think he can pull off the commercial product. I'm going to go ahead and give him a 9.25. Only because I think he's going, he can do headshots. He can do print. You know, bottom line. You can see him on one of the shows, The Twilight or something, as one of the guys that they will eliminate first. He can do headshots. <laughs> You're wrong. <laughs> You're wrong. Yeah. Okay, we're going to go to our last person or model. And David Bergworth. He's out of Australia, but I don't know what part of Australia. He says, I will play the bad man in a bad film. Is that true, Mario? Yeah, I think he can. He's got an interesting look. Mm, okay. Interesting look. All right. You know, uh, again, I wonder what his voice sounds like, but, you know, that's we hear about the pics. Right. And so I think, it's, I like the picture. I think it's selling something. Right. It's, it has a commercial vibe to me, whatever. I, you know, I'm never sure what that totally means. But right. For me, what I consider commercial, well. So I like it. And right. So I'm going to give him a 9.5. Okay, 9.5. Look, the bottom line is some, you know, some people fit those roles, their stereotypical roles, and you may not remember them specifically. And, and and that's just, you know, that's the way things are. But I actually can see him. I hate to say this, man. I can see him on something where he would be part of uh, one of the uh, second or third characters in the CSI Law and Order film. Or a bad man in a bad film. So oh, I, a vampire. I, How about a vampire? Oh, yeah. yeah. He can suck some blood. <laughs> you know you're wrong. Suck some, <laughs> suck some blood. Yeah, no, but bottom line, yeah, he can go commercial. It's, you know, and a lot of people don't want to. Suits will bring a different mm-hmm. background look. You may not be into it. That may not be your...